No! I'm assuming that's an invitation. Come look inside this bathroom where an old lady is taking a piss. I think if I play with this ritual on camera, I'll definitely win the contest. What oh, is ah. it? A pentagram in blood. I guess a little blood won't hurt to win the contest. I just need to find enough. What? I saw candles in the house. Listen, the amount of blood you would need to draw that. He'd be dead. He'd have no arm. Just have a bloody stump that's like spurting stuff out. No. Nope. 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 Dead soul come to us again through the barrier of life and death. Dead soul come to us again. No! You've got to have great big pendulous balls. To stay here after that, you've got to have the biggest balls known to mankind. Welcome to Dreamless. Every 25 years, horrifying events occur in a lost town in the south. For one week, August the 1st to the 7th, referred to as Death Week, Teenagers mysteriously disappear. City officials have long ago given up on the mystery and are simply closing missing persons cases, advising residents to stock up on essential supplies and not leave their homes. But even such measures don't save the day, and more people go missing every year. Is a serial killer who has passed his craft from generation to generation to blame for these terrible disappearances? Or is it a curse? Right then. Have I got a treat for you? If you're... Like me and you love a good spook, being as it's in scary season. Uh, this is a good one. So, our protagonist is John, who's a diligent senior year student with a passion for video blogging. On August the 1st, 2017, exactly one month before his coming of age, a new week of death arrives. The townspeople are busy going about their everyday lives and their business and seem to have already forgotten all about the curse. But not John. John receives a tempting offer from his friend Will, who explores the long abandoned house of a deceased old lady. Oh, why is it an old lady? Who once instilled terror in all of the residents. We've got photorealistic graphics. We've got high quality audio, apparently, creating an atmosphere of maximum fear. Unpredictable gameplay. The abandoned house will change as the game progresses creating new obstacles and puzzles for the player, learn the ancient history of the town and solve the mystery of mystical... Wait, how many mysteries, mysteries and mysticas? Misty, 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 uh, Solve the mystery of the missing children, basically. This promises a lot, and I hope it delivers. That, Like I said before in another video, there's a lot of really exciting horror games coming out, and uh, I only pick certain ones that I want to play on the channel, and I'm quite... Fussy with my horror games, and this is this is a good one, I think. This is one you're going to want to keep your eye out for. So let's play Dreamless. You need to take a backpack with a camera, record a little intro. Who said that? Um. Oh, God, look at the graphics. Look at the bike. Now then. This is a sexy bike, yo. Greetings, dear subscribers. Today we will ha. visit this, um... Marvelous place that once belonged to a wicked old lady. Ha! Ah, uh, good. Yep, fine. Why is it always an old lady? But, you know, old ladies are scarier than anyone else. Do I have a light? Oh, <gasps> no, I have a night light. Oh, that's terrifying. We can do this, guys. We're, um... I should put my backpack down and look around, see if I can find anything interesting. Where do you want me to put my backpack? What's this? Ah! No. Graphics are very nice. I'll give it that. Who's knocking? Examine. Of 
got a fingerprint slot. Someone's been thumbing it. It's not working. Mrs. Martha probably spent a lot of time listening to the news and various humour podcasts. And the grandkids are playing video games. It's a wonder no one's touched any of this stuff yet. She might not have liked uh, fucking, what did he say? Humour podcasts? She might have been into something else. She might have been into romance. Oh, can't go around that way. Oh, no, you are right, because there's a video game down there. Ha! My bad. The weird, creepy-looking lamb. Can I play the video game? Anything I can uh, nosy at? I just recorded another horror game that had the same lamp. What if it's the same people? And it had the same sort of... No, it's got to be. Ah. Alright, we've got a bag down. Yeah, it had the same chair. Night Fright or something, I think. It was the one I just recorded. Because I, I normally record a lot back to back. Which is why sometimes you see me wearing the same shirt. I'm not dirty. I wonder if it was the same people. I might have to have a look. Alan. Hey. Okay. No. No, we're not. We're not doing this. No. No. There's nothing spooky about this house. I'm assuming that's an invitation. Come look inside this bathroom where an old lady is taking a piss. That scare me. Ew! Uh, don't in drawers. Shut that. I'm in toothpaste. Clear tooth. Best for keeping your mouth clean. It is true that in the time it has been lying here, its use is likely to do fatal damage. Toilet's clean though. Oh god, I thought the bath was filled then for a minute. That always fills me a dread. Well, there's no in here. Good, because that's probably a basement. I don't want to go in there anyway. Cereal, crispy breakfast, cornflakes. Oh, not cornflakes! Now look, cornflakes are the worst cereal on the face of the earth. Out of every cereal that could ever be invented, cornflakes are the bane of society. They last about, I would say, about five seconds before it's one big globule mass of mush. <laughs> I despise cornflakes. Anyone that likes cornflakes is demented. Sorry, not fucking sorry. Oh, what's this? We've got law. Damn kids! Every day they harass me and my grandkids. They come in droves, throwing sticks, rocks, and other trash. The city department was cool about letting me off the hook. But who will compensate for the broken windows and clean up the garbage scattered around the house? I'm so fed up. Oh no. I always wondered why she was hated by the whole town. Oh. Kids are fucking horrible, that's why. They probably made her go a bit fucking... Ooh. 
A fly with the missing girl. There's eggs in the pan! An open, un, 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 unopened bag of flour. Probably expired. Probably should have gone into bread or some pancakes. But I guess it didn't. And I guess it won't. Cornflakes. Okay. Where am I going now? Going outside? No, I'm not going outside. I wonder if I go upstairs. I don't think I can go upstairs. I can't go in there. I really don't want to see this old woman. But I fear I'm going to. I don't know what that is. So I really about pulling the ugliest face. Oh god. Calling a demonic entity is carried out in an area with maximum paranormal activity, place of dead people or animals. In no case it is recommended to call especially dangerous ghosts, which can cause irreparable damage. Oh god, who did this? The, the procedure itself, draw a pentagram with blood, for better effect use the blood of an innocent victim. Place five candles around the edges of the pentagram. Light the candles. Put a personal thing of the deceased. If you do not know what kind of thing it was, use soft toys. They are always attached to the souls of deceased children. Read aloud the following. Dead soul come to us again through the barrier of life and death. Oh, three times. I'm not going to say it three times. <laughs> okay. Uh... So your grandmother was into the occult? Interesting. I think if I play with this ritual on camera, I'll definitely win the contest. What oh, is ah. it? A pentagram in blood. Sounds creepy. I didn't bring any paint, damn it. I guess a little blood won't hurt to win the contest. I just need to find a what? knife. I saw candles in the house. Lighter in my backpack. Otherwise, how would I smoke? <laughs> the urge to smoke saved me. A toy. Should be in the playroom, I guess. Now look, who in there, how badly do you need to win this contest? First of all, there ain't no contest on the planet, no prize in the world would make me go to this cursed house, do this demon, demonic ritual, and then also go, oh, I don't, I'll just slice a bit of my skin off of the ritual, that's all right. Fanny! We are not doing this ritual, are you serious? I'm not having it. I am not having it. Ah. Well, let's go slice a fucking finger off. Do you know how much blood you're gonna have to... Fuka. No, listen. Listen, the amount of blood you would need to draw that, he'd be dead. He'd have no arm. Just have a bloody stump that's like spurting stuff out. No. Nope. 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 I thought it was a pair of boobs. Nope. No. Nope. Hello. Get on with that. I don't want to hear your fucking music. Is it just one candle? No, it's more than one, isn't it? Let's uh, get this toy. Don't fucking scare me. I've not done the ritual yet. Oh, I can't. I think I've got to do it a step at a time. Okay, so we need candles. Any more candles? Oh. 
quite sure that wasn't there before though. Hey! Fucking hell, it's a big football. Fuck off. Yeah. What's that? No, I hear muttering. What is that? I don't like that. Muttering. Ah. How many do I need? I wasn't really fully paying attention. One, two, three, four, I need five. How many have I got? I've got an inventory. Okay, there's one more. Ah! It was hiding! Alright, place the candles. Oh yeah, I need to get my lighter, I forgot. Can I get this stuffed toy yet? No. What could possibly go wrong? I don't see any 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 issue whatsoever with this plan. This silly kid. Got no idea. <laughs> he's got no idea what he's about to run. Fucking. I won't then. You're not going to trick me. You are not tricking me. I am not. I refuse. No. 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 I'm not. No. I said don't look up though. <laughs> uh now what? What was it? I need to read it again. Candle, personal thing, ba 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 ba. Oh, I need to read that. How do I... Now what do I piss and do? Oh. Dead soul come to us again, through the barrier of life and death. Dead soul come to us again, no! through the barrier of life and death. Dead soul come to us again. Oh, this could be a song. Of life and death. Fuck me. What was that? Maybe no. it was Will's way of playing a prank on me so I'd be Funny. scared and win the contest. There's a reason he said he'd been here before. It's starting to rain. If I go home now, I'll soak all the equipment. Oh, 
Get I lost. Think we should spend the night here. Oh, yeah. Luckily, I should have a sleeping bag in my yeah. backpack. It's yeah. better than sleeping on half rotten mattresses. Perfect. Brilliant idea. Now, honestly, I've never known a more brilliant idea in my entire life. We've done this ritual that we've quite slicing off most of our skin to do it. Uh, and now we're going to sleep here. This is the stupidest person in the planet. You absolute fanny. There is no way you would sleep here. No, I'm not having it. I am not having it. It's a stupid idea. You've got to have great big pendulous balls. To stay here after that, you've got to have the biggest balls known to mankind. <laughs> yeah. All right. Fine. And we're going to wake up in a couple of hours and we're going to get... Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. That is horrendous, and I mean that in the best possible way, as far as a game being scary and horrendous. The full release is on October 25th. Oh, Christ, that's not that far away either. <laughs> well, <coughs> I will be playing it. I may not survive it, but I will be playing it. That was genuinely scary. I did record another demo before this that wasn't very good. It wasn't very scary. This put the shits up me. Very good. Very, very, very good. Well, I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did. And I, I hope you wishlist it and show your support. And I will see you in another video. Ta-ta. <gasps> Let me out.